Well, it is always a pleasure to have Carlin Hefner joining us. And Carlin, you've got once again another great event coming up at the UNOH Center. Yes. And this one is specifically geared for women. And you pull out some great crowds for these, don't you? Yes, we do. We do. And we're really excited this year. We're going to have Lisa Turkerst come and speak with us. And she will be speaking three times. So we are very honored to uh, get her in, in the northern area. Yeah. She doesn't really come up here too much. That's great. And um, Lisa is probably known to many women who watch us here on TV 44. Um, she is with Proverbs 31 mm -hmm. Ministries. Oh, it's funny because, um, you know, I always resisted social technology, social mm -hmm. media, and um, she is one of the favorites of mine oh, now absolutely. on Instagram, I think, and um, she's on Facebook and, and Twitter, and it's just mm -hmm. really nice to get her daily reminders. Right. You know? She has the first five app that you can put on your phone okay. also. Okay, yes. And uh, that's, it's really great. That wakes me up every morning. My phone goes off and then it's, you know, spend the first five minutes with God. Yeah, absolutely. Well, let's talk about the event. It's coming up in September, um, September 23rd and 24th. And that may seem far away, but it really isn't, it's is it? It's not. It is going way too fast. <laughs> yeah. For those of us that are planning, it's going way too fast. Um, on the 23rd, we're going to start at 9, mm -hmm. or at, at 6, I'm sorry. At six o'clock in the evening, okay. the doors will open at five, and it'll go till nine. Um, don't hold us to that schedule, though, completely. Right. You know, we right. don't know how God's going to lead, and we don't know what's going to happen. True. Um, and then on Saturday morning, the doors will open at eight, and then we will begin at nine o'clock and go till noonish. <laughs> so I'm going noonish. It's going to be, you know, 12, 12:30. I love that. Okay. And um, again, this is at the UNO, UNOH Event Center on Cable Road. And um, ticket prices are a little bit different depending on when you purchase tickets. Or right. Okay. Right. Right now we're doing the early bird special. Okay. Uh, the tickets are forty dollars, and then after June 30th, starting July 1st, they will go to fifty. At the door, then we will have them for fifty-five. Okay, and is this an event? Um, I know that everyone has busy schedules and sometimes to, to block out an entire mm -hmm. weekend can be difficult. So if someone is able to go to one or the other days, um, is that possible? Absolutely, okay. they are, they're not committed to coming to both. The ticket price does cover both days. Okay. But if you can't come to one of those days, hand your ticket to a friend and you know let someone else come and enjoy her. to, to Pay $40 and to be able to hear Lisa in person, I think is amazing. Um, kind of tell us a little bit about um, what else we will be able to participate in. I recognize the name John McKenna, yes. worship leader. <laughs> yeah, John will be there. Um, we've had him at our other conferences and he's coming back. He lives in Detroit uh, in the Macomb area, in Macomb Township. and. Um, so he will be coming back. He has his band together. Mia's going to be singing with him, with him again. Okay. And I'm sure she's, you know, well known to the entire community. It's always neat when you see buses um, from the local churches or women's groups in the mm -hmm. area. Um, is now the time to be contacting you? Are there group rates available? We don't have group rates. Okay. Um, but the Lima ladies need to um, get busy and okay. get their tickets because I'm having, I had one church up in the Detroit area that bought 100 tickets. And so um, Lima ladies are, are, you know, they're procrastinators yeah. and they're not buying their tickets just yet. So uh, Tip City, Van Wert, um, Kenton, um, there have been Bell Fountain, there have been a lot of areas that have called churches that really are spreading the word all around the area, and uh, we need these Lima ladies to get busy and get their tickets too. Now these are not reserved seats, right? So it's, no. okay, so no. that is especially important right. then. Right, it's first yes. come, first serve, so. Yeah, definitely. Yep. Well, if you could um, entice any of us through the message of Lisa, um, what is it that, that you think we will get from this um, overall? this weekend. Lisa has a, a new book that's coming out and this is what she's going to be speaking on. Um, it's called, it's entitled um, Uninvited and I was reading over what that book was about and it says the enemy wants us to feel rejected, left out, lonely and less than. When we allow him to speak lies through our rejection he pickpockets our purpose, cripples our courage and dismantles our dreams. 
and blinds us to the beauty of Christ's powerful love. And I think there is not a woman in Lima or the surrounding area that can't relate to that. And so to me, to get her, her wisdom, her direction, her life story of you know, how she has lived and the things that she's gone through, it just helps. It, it helps women. It, it's a, a social event, you know, to get together with your friends and everything, but yet to come and hear how God has provided for her and how he's changed her life, I think is amazing. And this is such an opportunity that we don't want to miss. You said it best, Carlin. Thank you very much for joining sure, us today. Sure, thank you. I wish you Appreciate all the very it. best. Thank you. All right, back to you.